Hello, this is Chaos Blue, and welcome to more Let's Play Golden Sun, The Lost Age. Last time, we snuck into a temple, and we are spontaneously completing the temple's trial because no one told us we couldn't. Um, pretty much. And that's where we are right now. Uh, before we get on with that, though, there's one thing I want to quickly show off. One of the synergies that Shiva is getting from having uh, this thing is a void, which, as it says, makes us encounter fewer monsters. I'm not going to use this right now, but this is the easiest, earliest way to get this ability in this game. In fact, you can't... And seriously, about the easiest part, because to get this in the first game, you need to do, like, crazy cross-classing things. Um... Now, Avoid, I'm not going to use it right now, but it is very useful for me to have, because I'm recording stuff. It means that whenever I'm in a situation where I want fewer encounters, I have it there for me. And the way it works, by the way, as far as I know, the way Evade works is basically, after you use it, you get, um, uh... It basically gates what you can encounter based on your level. So you will not encounter any enemies that are below a certain level threshold, with that level threshold determined by your party level. Now, right now, it would probably keep us from running into one party things, but maybe not the wolves? I don't really know. I don't actually know what the level's equivalents are for the enemies. But it is particularly useful later on, actually, when we'll be backtracking. Simply because... Well, because we'll be backtracking, actually. We'll be going to areas where we just don't need to be fighting anything, because we are so much stronger than it. And that's where it'll really come in handy. But that's not until later. And when it is that, that time, we'll have much easier solutions. Hey, this is the first time I've actually needed to use Synergy. Figure that one out. And now we can cross the thing. Oh hey, I guess I could have done that before. Whoops. Well, it doesn't really matter. And nowhere across. Anything down here? New. No. Okay, I think this is the end actually. It's gotta be close to it. Uh, oh, I do need to go up there, actually. Whoops. A maze! Ing. Maze. Ing maze. Ing maze. Yeah, okay, let's stop that. Um, let's do that. Okay, it's dead. Which means it probably is as well. Indeed. Mm, I should probably heal Felix. I mean, he could probably go a little further without it, but I may as well do it now and let him recharge his synergy. Instead of waiting until later when I really need it, I'm probably using my synergy for other things as well. Okay, so to complete this whole thing, we needed to use synergy exactly once. Keep that in mind. You know, let's try using Juggle. I don't think this deals damage, but Juggle does. Ha! Uh, oh. There's a Ginny up there. A water Ginny, but we can't reach it. Hmm. That's disappointing. But, well, I guess we'll just have to come back for it. Um. Hmm. Let's try that. Okay, that works. Cool. And we got a smoke bomb. What does this sign say? Extinguish your desire and the fire will cool. Empty your mind, and you will feel no pain. Or, I can cheat. 
Okay, so that's two times total I've needed to use Synergy. Oh, hey, I don't think these are supposed to be here. I mean, well. Okay, these are- that's boss music, so... Let's do that, let's do that, let's do Echo! Hopefully these are weak against fire. Oh yeah, they are! Triple e explanation point. Um, they're neutral to Earth, so that's, you know, nice. I mean, if they're resistant to Earth, that would kind of suck, so... Considering I'm about to unleash Venus! Seriously, though, I'm pretty sure we're gonna kill the- well, that's- that's all of them dead, and again, I haven't actually summoned anything, despite my best efforts. <laughs> And there's a ladder now, so you know that's convenient. Uh, sure, let's climb. Hola! You have passed a very difficult test. You have pleased your teacher! <laughs> he wasn't looking. Wait, you are not one of my students! Who are you? How did you come this far? Well, we only cheated a little bit. Um... The rope is still on the floor! You must have come through the cave! That means... I must give you the secret of Lash! Master P Poi, you seem perturbed. Oh no, not at all. Uh, He seems to want to give us something, so I'll give him the benefit of the doubt. No one from outside te the temple has ever passed the test. It's amazing! What indeed. Lash is a secret power! Passed down for years to the followers of the temple. Uh, indeed. And now, I must pass it on to you. It is our way. It is a gift to all those who pass the test, as it has been for ages. What indeed. It's the power to tie ropes! A little bit, yeah. Synergy, hmm? We call it spiritual strength, but it seems the same. The technique used, the spirit uses the spirit to affect the physical. One with strong spirit can lift and move heavy objects further. Interesting. The distance doesn't actually change, though. Um, those who cannot pass this cave's trial are not worthy of the technique. Um... No, not really. I mean, again, I only needed to use Synergy twice in the whole cave. Um, and one of them was to move a pot that he clearly put there himself. So, you are quite mistaken. You should listen to the- well, I mean, I mean, even if it was, that was his purpose, it clearly it doesn't do a very good job of it, is all I'm saying. Uh, yeah. Up we climb. After the old man. The old monk, really. This is the power and secret of our temple! If you are worthy, you will use it with ease. When you see a rope, use Lash on it. Perhaps you will find this useful in your travels. Take this power with you, and do good. We got the Lash Pebble! Which we are not going to give to Shiba, we're actually going to give to Jenna. Um... But, anyway... Now, we have a little bit of backtracking to do. Um... Give this to her... Yeah, I'm fine for the rest of that is. 
because there was a Mercury Ginny in this cave, and we now have the power to get it! So let's get it. After all, no sense in delaying. Of course, it being Mercury Ginny, it'll be a little bit tricky to equip it, um, as we do not have a Mercury Adept with us. So, you know, it'll be interesting figuring that out. I'm thinking I'm going to put it on Sheba as long as she has the card on her. But I won't want the card on her forever, is the thing. Um... Let's just, uh... Wait a second. Let's use Earthquake. I kind of feel like it. Well, that seems to have been fairly effective. And... Flash! You are my Ginny, although I should say first, because you seem to be in a dungeon, so I'll probably have to fight you. Oh yeah. Good call. And it's weak as fire, so I have a good setup. Juggle! Fume! Echo. I wonder if I can wipe it out in a single turn. Um... Nope, not quite. Uh, I guess I didn't take the damage into consideration, but... I mean, it's damage, that is, but I'm probably not going to be able to summon this again. I was correct. Beam? I know, I know how to beam. Hmm. That's interesting. So, it's probably worth... Fog. We'll look at that in a second. So it's probably worth mentioning that, m unlike Garrett, Jenna is a caster. Which is why she has so much more synergy and is so much more powerful than Garrett's. Uh, let's equip that, and let's look at Fog. Okay, Fog increases luck, which is pretty good. And... What does he do? Blinds enemies. If I gave this to Je Jenna, I would get Cure Poison, Blast, and Guard, but I would lose all my combat stuff. Which makes sense, because water is mostly a, uh... It's not very combat-oriented, really. It's not very offensively oriented. Water synergy. Okay, then. I guess we need to just run out now. And then... And then I can think of two other places, actually, where I want to use Slash. So we'll go do those next. Oh, sure, now you stay to the side. Mmm... Yeah, okay, this seems fine. And out we go. I better be able to loop this way, actually. I'll be able to No, I can, because there's a way down over here. And a way up over here. With the power of Lash. Which is nice, because he actually acknowledged that the shortcut is there. Haha! -ha! When I awoke, I learned that someone else had passed my test. How disgraceful. Yeah, what a disgrace. I should not be talking. Let us leave. Kinda too bad there's no inn here. But what you gonna do? Not much. Um... Is this a shortcut? It is a shortcut! Let's take the shortcut. Hmm... I'm probably gonna rest at the inn when I get there, so let's do this. Ah! And everyone died. Yeah, I'm out of PP. So, hmm, as for the, the, uh, as for these items, generally they're pretty good early on, because they give you a big boost right off the bat, but as the game progresses they aren't so good. Also, each one uses a different type of j synergy to advance, much like the regular characters, but it sort of takes over the normal one and doesn't really tell you what it is. But in general they're a lot more limited. 
Which is why they aren't as good as the game progresses. Still, they do have their uses. And actually, I could sell it if I wanted to for some money, but I'm I'm probably not going to sell them. I don't really have any need to, so yeah. Anyway, we're actually here for a reason other than resting at the inn. Uh. Oh, I came up to the wrong area. Is there a thing in here? Nope. I must have already looted it. No, I actually want to go in. Here. Because. Oh, wait, no, I still can't do this, can I? I could have sworn I needed Lash for this. Well, shows me, I guess. Time for Plan B! Wait, did I just say V? I meant B. B! Um, this is actually kind of annoying navigating around. Okay, there is still one other thing that I know uses laugh for sure. And that is the Temple of Poseidon! Shrine of the Sea God, I guess. Wait, no, it's not the Temple of Poseidon? Maybe the other place is the Temple of Poseidon. Whatever. I mean, it's the Shrine of the Sea... Of the... Eh, talking is hard. It's the Shrine of the Sea God, so it's basically the same difference. Clash! Awesome! Uh, your friend is not here. I did all the work. Who are you? We are just passing through. We're the ones who saved you. Because you were a child in distress? I mean, that's really all there is to it. Hey, Tavi! How do you get down from there? Indeed. Well, I mean, I think Felix is like 14, so I don't know if I call him a grown up, but maybe he's 15, actually. In any case, he's actually easily the youngest party member. Well, actually, I say that. I think, I think she was the same age as him. Jenna is definitely like two years his senior year, though. Well, yeah, except that every time I was about to grab him, he flies off! Wait, what? Is there a Ginny here? I wasn't really paying attention. Yeah, I'm actually starting to get hungry too, so this is probably going to be the last episode in this particular batch I record. Um... <laughs> Although if it- well... Anyway, what's up here? Uh, I can go down here. This is the way out, though. So... There is a... Uh, nothing? Really, there's nothing here. I mean- OH, THERE'S A GINNY! How do I catch him, though? Hmm... There's no enemies here, so that's nice. It means I won't need to fight the genie if I do- Oh, I spoke too soon. Son of a submariner. You know, I think she has less MP as a juggler. Oh well, whatevs. It's no biggie. You missing, however, is a biggie. Damn it. Felix. Stop doing that. Did not learn any magic that time. That's a little disapp- Oh, that fell off. Okay. It's not going down. So... What? Where the- where did it go? Hmm... I wonder... Oh, that didn't- really? That's disappointing. I guess I need Felix to two-shot them. And an elixir, which are pretty worthless. And oh, hey, there's steps here. I wonder what's up with that. Steps here as well. Um, 
No steps here, though. Oh, there's the Ginny! Okay, then. Okay, then. Okay, then. The Ginny was a... It's right there. Uh... Please tell me I don't need to free stuff to catch the Ginny. That would kind of suck. Ooh, I see where this is going. Ha, ha, ha. You're mine. After I save, because you definitely are going to try to run away. I mean, fight me. Well, I mean, with a Jupiter Ginny, it's basically the same difference. By default, they tend to run away. Um, let's use this. And you can use... I think you might do more damage, but I want to use Beam. And... Echo. BAM! Yeah, okay. Fume would have done more damage, but it would not have been as satisfying. Summon a Ginny, and do Fume, and do Venus. Well, not that much more damage, actually. And I still haven't managed to summon freaking Venus yet. Man. <laughs> okay, now I do have a bit of an issue, though. I don't want that stuff on you. So, what would it look like if I did this? Uh, that, well, Gaia is actually really powerful, but... Let's just leave you unset for now, then I'll fix stuff up once the... There we go. We're gonna do that, and that, and that. And... Remove that, and check your synergy. You didn't learn anything new, really? Wow. Okay. Which one of these do I actually want? Restores HP? I want breath. But I do actually still want uh, this for now. Let's see, let's give these to her. And let's give the herbs to her, actually. Now that I have a Ginny that can restore life. Let's see. I'm gonna need to come back for this stuff, unfortunately. Because I don't have any way to freeze water. Which is a little bit disappointing. It's a ghost? I don't care. Uh, okay, I care a little bit more now, if only because I didn't manage to kill it in a single round. But actually, looking at the time, it's about time I stopped. So, join me next time when we continue to explore the Shrine of the Sea God. But until then, this has been Let's Play Golden Sun The Lost Age with Chaos Baloo, and have a good day. Bye!